Last night I was reading a book and it posed the question to make a list of what you love and lust about yourself. This is something that I do with my clients all the time. I ask them to name things that they like about themselves or what they love about themselves and what can we do to bring more love and like in if they don't feel that yet. And it's something that in my own journey I had done years ago when I was about midway through um, the initial part of doing a lot of healing from my own trauma growing up with a narcissistic mom. And at that time, when I first did the list of what I like about myself and what I love about myself, I was amazed that I could name even more than three things. And then doing this again last night, I was going hard on this list. I named about 60 different things, both physically and just internally that I love about myself before I decided to take a break. This is really important because for many of us that grew up with toxic or narcissistic moms or parents, we were not taught that it was acceptable to love ourselves, let alone say that out loud. In fact, we would be shamed for it and we weren't given that love back to validate ourselves. We weren't taught that we were worthwhile and wonderful beings on this planet. So it's a radical act of reclamation when you can actually say, I love myself. And you can make a list of all of the ways that you love yourself physically and non-physically.